All right, guys. So I'm going over. I replaced the distributor cap. Now I'm going over the ignition wires. Um, right now, what I'm doing is I'm trying to identify which is the, is the uh, longest ignition wire and which one is the smallest ignition wire, and trying to find the in betweens. So this one will be the longest. And this one will be the second longest. This one will be the third, and this one will be the smallest. So the two small ones I'm gonna put over to the side. Now I have the uh, I left the ignition wires and the distributor cap right here, and again, so if I line them up, the longest one, the longest one is gonna be on the on the rightmost. The second, the second longest is gonna be on the bottom. So I could go right ahead, take this out. Oh, I'm not take it out. So I can go right ahead and take out this to put so long as I can now put right here Second one, right here. Done. Go to the side. Now I have third. We have that one. Third one. This is that one. Future. This one. Oh, another tip, whenever you're taking out the ignition wire and it's um, it's either your first time or you haven't done it in a while, so that so you don't um, break the wire itself or the uh, coil that's inside of it, you want to twist the ignition wire cap, the, the top of the ignition wire, and then you pull on it. That'll loosen it up. So here's the last one, last ignition wire. I'm not plugging them in here yet because I'm going to replace the uh, spark plugs. And then just connect it. Last one here. I'm gonna connect it to you here. Click this one, little faint click. Ah, there 